Alrighty, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all how I got from literally from completely to nothing to literally. Yeah, we totally like look so look different from each other. Girl, you're scared. Girl. But yes, I'm gonna show you how we're gonna get into this look. Girl, shush. But yes, okay. you're supposed to be dead. Shush. So. Without further ado, let's get on into it. Alrighty, so now that I'm in all of the position where I literally am about to put this on. So for this look, um, specifically, there's a lot I'm gonna do today for this. So, first and foremost, um, I am going to put on, um, so of course when you're like dead, you get like this grayish like type of fleshy look. So of course I grabbed out my um Halloween makeup. It's just a Halloween makeup kit that I just got from Walgreens. Seriously, I just got it and it has a little kit on says like what you can use, which colors like you can use on what part of your face because of course you can't just use all of them on your face. On here there is a gray on here, so I am going to dive in with my one brush here and just literally paint like my face basically gray and i'm not gonna paint it all like completely gray where i'm like this gray girl like what the heck no it's gonna be like shades of gray and then i'm gonna get um and then i'm gonna have i'm gonna obviously put some white pieces in because i'm gonna put in um some uh red areas where it's like i got cut open because i'm a zombie like i got cut open my flesh is rotty nasty so like right about like this like I uh, like I have the gray like it's barely noticeable but it's not intensified to where I'm like I'm gray so I'm gonna dip into the white right now and throw in like where I want to put like cuts and stuff so right right here I'm also gonna have a cut on my eye but obviously it's gonna be like a different type of cut so I'm not gonna put white on that but I am gonna do like up here Right here would be very cute. And then down here, got cut on my chin. And then right here, I'm gonna do like, I got split open. Like someone like stabbed me with a, with a sword cause I was in battle and I lost the battle between like, I don't know, I'm thinking of like from Seven Deadly Sins or something like that, but yeah. I'm honestly gonna take out my other um, makeup palette to make these look more realistic, but obviously this is just sorry, honey. I'm gonna add some black in it because it's gonna look like I'm kind of I'm going for like a like I'm like a very old like I'm like I'm like a dead person, like you know what I'm saying? Like I'm like dead. Okay, so I got this base practically. So now I'm going to focus on the eyebrows, but for my eyebrows, I'm not gonna do perfect eyebrows. Obviously, I'm not gonna do perfect eyebrows. I'm a dead fairy i got messed up so i'm actually gonna do a cut on right here on my eyebrow so i'm gonna make it practically disappear so i'm gonna take that and i'm gonna do just go over with this just to kind of form where i want my eyebrow to be disappeared at okay so now that i got all that complete and my eyebrows are kind of done obviously they don't look really that much different because obviously i'm dead i'm not supposed to have perfect like put on eyebrows and stuff like that i'm dead but now we are going to be working on literally the owies i like to call them owies but I'm, i don't like the the scars the the bruises how i got hurt so much and stuff like that because i'm a new deadly fairy this is what i'm trying to go for so for that i'm gonna grab out of course my palettes again if you guys want to know what i use for down um uh, like what i use and i don't show in my videos of course in the description box below if you guys just look in there i'll it says products not shown and down there i literally list everything i have not shown you guys or i have shown you guys just so that if you guys are like girl that was popping lipstick or something like i wanted that like you can literally just like find where i got it from or the actual like what's it called so there's a little tip there so now that we are into the whole bruising of this whole thing so i don't really like to show um people how to make bruises so for this one we're gonna skip so i'm really sorry um to not show you guys but i don't want um anyone to take these 
because my bruises look real like and stuff like that so like i've been told like i took pictures and of course i posted them i'll even show you guys right now i posted them and literally people were like dude did you get beat the hell up like what the hell is wrong like what the hell happened like oh my god no i don't and i don't want to show people like how to do it like really how to go in depth with the freaking cut and stuff like that I don't want people to freaking scare their parents or anybody else around them. So for this part, I'm just going to skip. And then we're going to talk, of course, after I get this whole bruises on and um, scars. Alrighty, so obviously I went a little crazy on the dead part. But I'm looking pretty dead. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm looking pretty dead. So perfect. So I, am, I put the red lipstick on specifically just for, I don't know, a little effect. I don't know why I did, but just for a little cute little like warrior effect like she smeared the lipstick i don't know why i went for that but i did so i got all that on everything and now it's time to put on of course the white fairy part so for this part i am just going to do an eye an eyeliner um fairy look for this white fairy i am thinking a very like not just a regular eyeliner i want to do something weird just very weird so i'm gonna do a poke right here as a starter and then i'm gonna do like a tiny one so it's like a little like kind of wing dotted base now that we have that base of that little like dot thing I'm thinking of doing, so fairies are very like majestic, like crazy out of the world type of like makeup or even sometimes no makeup. So for this, I wanna do a very majestic, like indifferent type of look. So on this right here, and then I'm gonna do underneath is gonna be a second wing. I'm gonna do a tiny wing on the bottom of the long one. Just a tiny one. Alrighty, y'all. So I am looking crazy, and but that is what I want. So I have, of course, the the heart is stabbed. Ugh. So now I'm kind of wanting to make it look like the white is now starting to become black. Like I'm actually dying of a fairy. Like my white is starting to fade away. Like I'm actually going to full form die. So for that, I'm gonna take my black eyeliner and I think I'm just going to like seriously go on some parts of only the left side since it is the most side that is like fucked up um and just outline with black and to kind of seem like it's like fading out to this way of like my white's fading away so that's what i want to go for so let's do it so And then I will look like basically like this, just very like starting on the dark and then it's gonna fade on in and it's like getting towards this, but it hasn't touched really this side yet, except for the freckles. So for that, of course, I'm gonna add on fake blood and then we're gonna talk. 
Alrighty, y'all. So this is the finished look. Like a complete dead fairy. A complete dead fairy. Like my hair is all messed up because I'm dead and I got messed up. I am loving this look. I, of course, I added some things into it to make it look like more brought out, but yeah, I'm looking in my mirror here and of course I love it. I am ready for a Halloween scare and ready to scare some little kids for real. Yeah, I am loving it, especially how the fairy itself look without the dead, of course, looks amazing. I actually liked it. I didn't know what fairies really fairly go for. This is just literally amazing. I love it. And of course, with this whole side with the black and it fades on into that whole white, like my white is dying. Like my fairiness is like dying away too with me. Like I'm fully dying. And of course, this part literally blew me away. Like I love how it, it literally sparks out like I'm a fairy, like I have magic, something, I'm different. Like I, that's what I love about this whole look is that I look different. But I really guys hope you guys enjoyed this look and the journey of this look because I loved it. It's like so crazy. I look crazy, but I look amazing though. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys have a good day or night for whatever time you guys are watching this. Bye-bye.